Welcome back everybody, David Shepard here on the Humble Hot Shot channel, coming to you from beautiful sunny South Florida today with another truck bed load. And I thought you guys might be curious, running these uh, just little truck bed loads, if they pay well and kind of why I would even take on stuff like that. You guys have seen me do quite a few motorcycle transports in the past most of them just right in the back of the pickup bed so i'm going to get all into that show you guys the load we're hauling this time and explain some of those truck bed specific things uh right after a word of scripture so today i want to share romans chapter 11 verse 33 which says oh the depths of the riches and wisdom and knowledge of god how unsearchable are his judgments and how inscrutable his ways so I wanted to share that with you guys. Always want to encourage you guys to read the Word of God, read the Bible for yourself, and it's just an unending source of, of amazing wisdom and knowledge that can be gained from that. So praise God. I hope you guys will just read the Bible with an open heart and an open mind and be blessed by those scriptures. So now I'm going to get right into the load behind me. Once again, just a little good paying truck bed load. Actually, it's KLR 650 dual sport motorcycle. So, a lot of times I will run these truck bed loads just to fill in the gaps, um, and only if it's really close, um, basically to eliminate deadhead miles. I'll basically just fill in the gaps of those deadhead miles with a paying load in the truck bed to pick up another power only in this case. So, this one was close to my last drop off and paying pretty well, and I am going to get into the numbers this time because. If you watched my uh, power only cost per mile revealed, you guys know it cost me conservatively, it's kind of a high number I think, but conservatively about 45 cents per mile to run this truck down the road. And um, you know, that's what it costs with the fuel, the maintenance, the insurance, all the overhead that goes into it. That's uh, my best summation of those numbers is around 45 cents per mile. So you could say rather than just deadheading completely empty, Anything paying 45 cents or better is profitable. Now, I won't take on loads quite that cheap, even if it's just in the truck bed, because, you know, even if you're covering your expenses or, um, sorry about that, we got a little emergency activity behind us. Let them cruise back. Or what they're going over the causeway for but anyway i won't take on loads quite that cheap just because you are taking on the liability of that cargo you know if you were to have a claim on your commercial insurance policy that's going to raise your rates that's going to cost you money in the long term so i won't run anything quite that cheap even if it would just be deadhead miles otherwise and i guess that's a threshold that everyone will have to decide for themselves. But for me, I will run these little truck bed loads to fill in those deadhead miles for as low as 75 cents per mile. That's kind of my personal threshold. Again, it depends on your operating costs. We have uh, the humble setup and pretty low overhead compared to a lot of those full CDL hot shots. So, oh, Lord God, I pray everyone's all right out there on the beach and uh, pray for your hand on that situation. Anyway, guys, thanks for listening. I did want to share the, uh, the pay on this one, show you guys the numbers, and disclose that stuff. And as always, just encourage you guys to be creative when looking for different ways to fill in the gaps, especially with the power only work. You know, if you got an eight foot truck bed, no point in uh, running empty if you could make a little money and, uh, you know, continue to be profitable in that way. So, God bless you guys. I hope each of you will continue to uh, read the word or if you haven't already dive into God's word with an open heart and an open mind and I think it'll really be a blessing to you guys so praise God thanks for watching quick video today but we're going to get more power only content coming soon and uh, I'll see you on the next one see ya